So good morning guys. Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, so this morning I woke up and my kids were all over the place, all of them saying that they wanted waffles for breakfast. So I said, okay, waffles it is then. So I'm going to show you some simple tips on how you're going to, how you'll be able to make waffles for yourself. Okay. And I also have a waffle maker. Let me show you the waffle maker. This is a waffle maker, right? So here is it. The ingredients I usually use for these waffles are simple ingredients that you can find anywhere in the market. Even some of them are even lying in your house and everything. So one of them is the flour, sugar, salt, um, baking powder. Then you need eggs, milk. Simple recipe. So it's almost the same recipe that you use for pancake. Almost, yeah, kind of similar. I think it's the machine that makes the whole difference on pancake and waffles so today is waffle day for the girls and I thought to bring you along to see how I make waffles for them so you could also learn how to make waffles okay so first thing is um, the, okay let me show you the ingredients that I'll be using for this waffle I'm sorry guys I think you're not seeing my face okay let me push the camera up so you can see my face right but I, um when in making this thing you might not see my face because of the position of the camera so i hope you understand but i'll try and make it very easy for you to understand how i make these waffles okay guys hope you don't mind not seeing my face the most important thing is for you to see the ingredient and the whole mixing i think that's the most important okay so these are my ingredients this is my flour. Mm. This is where well, I have three cups of flour here. Then I have my eggs. I'm going to be using three eggs. I'll also, this is my sugar. I'll also be using sugar. This is my salt. And then um, I have milk here. I have two different brands of milk. This is full cream milk. And then peak. But I won't be using, this is peak milk. You know? For my nigerian people i'm sure you can get this or if you're in diaspora you might be able to get something similar to this so i won't be using these two at the same time i'm going to be using only one of this i'm going to be using either of them either this or this but for today i think i might make use of this yeah okay so let's get started so first things first and this is my baking powder this is my baking powder okay so first things first what we're going to do first now is um, mix the dry ingredient first then before we mix our wet ingredient then when we are able to separate these two we will now mix them together okay next thing that goes into this flour will be sugar so here because i have three cups of flour here i'm going to be measuring three spoons three tablespoons of sugar three tablespoons of sugar right this we do for this recipe next is salt now we're we'll putting half table half teaspoon of salt half teaspoon of salt right this will do okay next is the baking powder so this I'll just be putting only one tablespoon of baking powder. Here you go. I'm going to sprinkle it all around. So I guess I'm done with the dry ingredients. Next, I'm going to whisk this all together. Right? So here you go. I'll make mix this together. Then in a separate bowl, I'll be mixing the wet ingredients in a separate bowl before I mix them all together. Okay, so I'm going to put, right? So 
So these are my eggs. Next is, I'm going to put the milk. I've measured one cup of milk. Next, I'm going to mix the egg and the milk together. So I'm trying to be careful so it doesn't spill. Some people use melted butter, but because I'm running away from fat, so I'll be staying away from butter. I'm not going to be adding butter to this recipe, right? So you can also make, you can still make your waffles without butter and it will still come out fine. Okay, so this is it. Next, we're going to dig a hole in the floor and then we'll pour our wet ingredients in just like this, right? Okay, and then we begin to mix together. And I'm going, also going to be adding water to it because it's too thick here we go So now here I don't want it to tick. I don't want it to tick. So I'll be adding a little bit a little more water in it so it don't be too thick. Okay, so next we're gonna be heating our waffle maker. This is the waffle maker. We're gonna heat it for some minutes before we make use of it. Okay, it is on. I just switched it on okay so um, we've mixed all our ingredients together and here is the end result this is how it looks like you can see the thickness the thickness is not so thick you see it's running right it's running in, it's not so thick so this is perfect for our waffles so now we're going to rub a little granola here on the waffle maker just a little just to oil it, to oil the waffle maker. Just a little. Okay, so now that is oiled already with granite oil. I'm using granite oil. Some people use butter. Now I'm going to turn on this waffle maker. You can see it's on. And let it get hot. Okay, so I guess it's enough. I let this heat for three minutes. It's time to put in... Okay, so this is it. Cover it and let it and let it do its job. 
I'll let it heat for three minutes. Hey, Mia. Hey, Mommy. How are you? I'm fine. You're fine? What are you doing? I'm making waffles. I'm waffles. Yes. Tamara and Gemma said they wanted waffles. Do you want waffles too? Waffles too. You want waffles? I want waffles too. Okay, you're going to have waffles as well. All right? All right. Thank you, baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we can go now. Bye. This waffle is ready. Let's take a look at it. Wow, can you see this, guys? So, our waffle is ready. It is ready, Mia. So we're just going to drop this in here. See? Beautiful looking waffles. Yes, beautiful looking waffles. Right? <laughs> My third daughter is two years old. She's still learning how to talk. And <laughs> everything I'm saying, she's saying it after me. So these are waffles. Can you see? Perfect breakfast for the family. My daughters love these. Like they can eat these. Like they don't mind eating it every blessed day. They don't mind eating it every blessed day. So sometimes I try to even hide the waffle maker and make them believe that it's not working properly. So that we don't eat waffles. Because anytime you ask them, what do you want to have for breakfast? What do you want to have for waffles? waffles? We don't get tired of this. So kids love this a lot. Okay. So now we're going to be making another one. Yes, Mia. We're going to put another one. Mia, why are you interrupting my video? So we're just spreading this all around the maker. Okay, and then we close for another batch. So guys, you won't believe that the first one I made just finished. Finished. This children finished it. Now here's the second batch. You can see it's ready. So, Tamara, you guys are going to have to wait for breakfast first, okay? Because you guys are always finishing it. You can see how beautiful looking is. Look, look at so fine. So beautiful and tastes so good. These waffles. Waffle, waffle, waffle. Mia, hold on. All right, Mama. Hold on, Mia. Hold on, Mia. Mia, hold on, guys. You hold on, Mama. Come to the so you can say hi. Mia, hold on. So, this is Tamara. Hello. Hi, this is my second daughter. My second baby. There you go guys beautiful looking waffles I say hello to mama's these waffles are delicious you can't wait to dig into them right mm -hmm. you can't wait to dig in Almost done. This is going to be amazing, guys. We're almost done. 
okay so i guess the last batch is almost ready wow yes it's ready so i'm just gonna bring this out again all right okay so these are all the waffles that we have made today right look at them i'm just gonna put them here This is it is all the waffles that we made today and this goes very well with maple syrup but i didn't find maple in the market but this is also a pancake and waffle syrup so this is going to go well with it and then cup of tea for the kids okay so i'll just drop this one here and um let me quickly wash my hands Okay guys, so I hope you've learned one or two things on how to make waffles. At least even if you didn't know how to make waffles before, now you have an idea of how waffles are being made. This is what we've made today. So, thanks for sticking around on this vlog. Till my next video, bye for now.